Sit up slowly. Where am I? You're home. Home? How did I get here? I drove us here after you passed out. Oh, I passed out. Yeah, you drank a bottle of cooking wine, remember? Yeah. I, that was crazy. I, I know that it's no use to apologize because it's no excuse for what I did. You, you don't have to say you're sorry. You don't have to say anything. Everything's going to be all right now. How? You said that we could fix this together. And we are. You promised me that you weren't going to bring me back here, and you did. You lied to me. No, Carly, listen to me. Nothing's changed. Prove it. Let's go. Let, let, let's go back. We were happy there, Craig. It can work. We'll just get in the car and we'll go back. What's going on? You can't leave. Not in the condition that you're in. My condition is fine. You don't know what you're talking about. Let's go, Craig. Don't make me leave without you. What is going on? Hello, Carly. Don't you hello me. What the hell are you doing in my house? Carly, just calm down. I'm calm. What do you think you're doing? It's really simple. We love you, and we want to help you. You think ganging up on me is gonna help me? We're not ganging up on you, but we need you to listen to what we have to say this now. This is ridiculous, and I certainly do not have to listen to you. Carly, we're here because we're on your side. And so you thought you'd ambush me in my own home? You can save it, sister. I'm not interested. Parker, you do not have to go along with this. Would you sit down? Please. I don't really know what's going on here. I know, baby. I know. I'm sorry that they involved you in this. I'm all right. You're not. It's really scaring me. Carly, the things they've told you about me, they're not true. Mom, I don't need someone to tell me that there's something wrong with you. You know, when I called you, she was hiding from me. She was so worried I'd be mad at her for drinking, she actually, she hid like a child. Well, that's the way alcoholics behave, Craig. <sighs> Do you think this is going to work? I have no idea. But at this point, I'm kind of run out of options. What are you doing here? Can I talk to you? Listen, I don't want to make this about me, but I feel horrible about the way I've been acting. It's okay. No, it's not. I know why you're doing this, and if there's anything I can do to help, I'd like to try. You can leave, Carly. No, 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 no. This is not a spectator sport. I'm not on display here. So go! In fact, all of you, go! Get the hell out! Sorry, Carly. We're not going anywhere. I cannot believe that I actually thought that you had changed. How could the great Craig Montgomery possibly love anybody other than himself? I'm doing this because I love you. No, you don't. You get me the hell out of here. You're afraid of them. Coward. Carly, come on. For once, Craig is doing the right thing. You need help. Yes, maybe I do need help, but not the kind that you're talking about. You want to send me away. I just want you to be with people who can give you the professional help that you need because you're destroying yourself. Day by day, drink by drink, we're losing you. I'm right here. No, and here apparently is the one place you don't want to be. So what exactly did you all do? Did you all get together and, and plan this? You said, hey, let's let's humiliate Carly. We'll all show up together and take turns calling her a drunk. Carly, we're not here to humiliate you. And you. Oh, I bet you're really enjoying this, aren't you? No, actually, I'm not. Isn't that why you're here? 
so you can finally feel superior. Stop crying. It's okay. It's all right. Admit it. This is what you've been waiting for. They send me away. You win. Jack will finally be free of me. Won't you, Jack? I'm not playing this game. Mm -hmm. Not in front of the missus. It just eats you up, doesn't it? How he refuses to cut himself off from me. Even so, there are still limits to what you can demand of people, Carly. And I've reached mine. Fine. Where are you going? If you think that I'm going to stay here and be lectured by you people, guess again. Parker. Move. No. Stay for me. This isn't about you. Mom, I love you. I love you. But when you're drinking, it's like you're not even here. You're, you're a completely different person. And I don't love that person. Listen to me. I'm your mother. I will always be your mother, no matter what. So when you're asking me not to tell dad things, when, when I'm taking your keys away from you, and when I'm trying to keep Sage from seeing just how hungover you are, that's you being my mother? You want to get it together? I am. How? My own way. But I, I can't do it like this. I thought you understood that. Please let me go. Mom, you left us once before, and you promised you would never do that again. I'm gonna come back. Mom, if you leave, you will never see me or JJ or Sage again. The Mentalist, New Night in Time, Thursday after CSI. Parker, I would never leave you. But it's already happened, Mom. You've left because right now you're not really here. You'd rather be at some bar somewhere. No, don't say that. You don't want a drink? What I don't want is this. What? Everyone caring about you? No. People telling me what to do. People who don't even know me. Who here doesn't know you? I think she means me. And she's right. I don't belong here. This is a family matter. You just realizing that now, or are you? I just wanted to move. I'm going to wait outside. I'll walk you up. Sorry, right, she's giving you such a hard time. She's just looking for an easy target. I know. Normally, I'd let it get to me. Seeing her like this. I tried to tell you, Jen. I know. And I'm so sorry. I gave you hell for coming to her rescue all those times. But Jack, she really needs you now. 